Here is your latest African news bulletin. South Africa. Fully vaccinated South African President Ramaphosa tests positive for COVID-19. South African President Cyril Ramaphosa is receiving treatment for mild COVID-19 symptoms after testing positive for the virus on Sunday. The President started feeling ill after he left a state memorial service held in honor of former Deputy President F.W. de Klerk in Cape Town. Last week, Ramaphosa visited four West African countries. He and all members of his delegation were tested for COVID-19 in each of the countries during the trip. President Ramaphosa is 69 and fully vaccinated. He has delegated all responsibilities to Deputy President David Mabuza for the coming week. Burkina Faso Burkina Faso's President Christian Kabore dissolves government. Christian Kabore, President of Burkina Faso, has dissolved the government amidst public protest against insecurity in the country. The country has seen continuous protests by the people against the government for its inability to deal with attacks from jihadists. Burkina's Prime Minister submitted a letter of resignation to President Rok Mark Christian Kabore last Wednesday, who accepted it. The resignation of the Prime Minister automatically entails the resignation of the government, according to Burkina Faso's law. Nigeria Nigeria's aviation minister, Captain Hadi Sirika, has announced that the country has banned flights from Britain, Argentina, Canada and Saudi Arabia with effects from Tuesday, December 14th. The decision was made to retaliate for a previous action taken by the country's authorities to ban Nigeria following the discovery of the Omicron variant by South African scientists, a move considered unfair towards Nigeria. Several countries have restricted the movement of people from some African nations since the Omicron variant was first detected. Cameroon Samuel Eto'o elected president of Cameroonian Football Federation. Former Cameroonian star and four times African Player of the Year Samuel Eto'o has been elected president of the Cameroonian Football Federation. According to the electoral provisions, he will oversee next year's Africa Cup of Nations, which will take place in Cameroon and manage the affairs of the Federation for the next four years. Eto said his election as president of the Cameroon Football Federation was one of the proudest moments of his life. The Cameroon striker who lifted the Champions League with Barcelona and Inter Milan won the election with 43 votes from members of Fekafoot's General Assembly. Africa wide. Miss South Africa has been crowned as the second runner-up at the Miss Universe pageant. Her attendance has been surrounded by controversy with South Africa's government withdrawing its support for Lalela Mswane over Israel's treatment of Palestinians. Miss South Africa, Lalela Mswane, finished second runner-up in the Miss Universe contest held in Israel. Thanks for watching. You can directly support us in this new series by joining our membership program or funds membership subscription on the button below. Visit our news website weloveafrica.net to stay updated with all the latest African developments and future events. Remember to share, like and leave your comments down below.